anyways i'm just gonna do a quick intro because i tried doing this vlog without an intro and it just it seemed weird with the pacing so um as requested on my tumblr i'm going to be doing a day in the life video today it's a bit of a short one um because i as you will see i do go out in public quite a bit and you can only film so much without looking like a complete weirdo <laughs> um but yeah as you'll see um that's what i do most days um cut to voiceover jasmine i guess <laughs> Okay, so I try to get up at 6am most days. I'm really not a morning person. I'm definitely more of a night owl, but I try to be just so I have enough time in the day to get stuff done and have a somewhat healthy sleep schedule. Um, at the moment, I'm just getting ready to go and do some school. I'm homeschooled at the moment. I'm doing my last year of A-levels, so I am actually getting ready to go to my local library. Um, but as you'll see in a second, my library is not normal. It's um, It feels like you're going to Hogwarts most days because it's a historical one. I think it's built by like a Victorian prime minister or something like that. Um, so as you'll see in a second, it's quite historical. Um, but it's a very good place to study. I usually spend about three or four hours a day there, um, depending on how bothered it can be, because anyone who ta takes those subjects will tell you that um, maths and physics, you can only do it so long before getting burnt out. So I stayed there from nine till 12 that day before going home and walking my dog Harley. We have this um, castle grounds near my house, so we usually go around there. If you couldn't tell, I live in quite a historical village. Um, I grabbed a brownie on the way home though, and then did some writing. I am currently writing my fourth book, which I can say the title in this video, it's called Beyond the Isles. Um, I try and write about a thousand words a day, sometimes it's a lot less, sometimes it's a lot more. It, the, the motivation comes and goes and very drastically, but a thousand is the main goal. Um, and hopefully it will be out quite soon after this video comes up. It's due to release on New Year's Day. Um, but yeah, I'm really enjoying writing it at the moment. <laughs> and then I worked on my website a little bit and did some reading. I'm currently reading Emily Wilde's Encyclopedia for Furries. I have been wanting to read this book for months. Could I find it in a shop anywhere? No, I've only just recently bought it, so I was very excited to read it. I then did some bullet journaling. This design's by Amanda Rachelido, because I'm really not good at coming up with them, and some Italian. And then I worked on my uni application, because I am applying at the moment. Um, I try to cook most days. Emphasis on trying. I'm really not a good chef. I'm very good at baking, not so good at like making meals and stuff like that, but I'm trying to get better because obviously it's my last year before I go to uni when I have to fend for myself. So at the moment I'm making some tandoori chicken with noodles. That's the final product if anyone wants to see it. Um, I then did some marketing and worked on some YouTube videos and then I went to bed. So that's it for this video, I hope you guys enjoyed, um, it's a bit of a short one, maybe one day I'll do like a week, we'll see. Um, if you guys are interested though, I have two other videos that should be up right now, uh, one of them is a deep dive into folklore episode about mermaids, and the other one is some <laughs> spooky baking, it's more bonfire night and Halloween, which as of filming this, it's the 24th of October, but it's probably way gone Halloween at that point. But you know, just, just some autumn vibes if you want to go and check that out. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. Bye!